what we're doing is taking one chapter and for each of the 12 months of the year, we're memorizing a whole chapter so that by the end we can say it cold turkey. And I'm encouraging you to take this month to learn Psalm 46. Wherever you've started is fine in this journey along the way. But when you come across this video, I hope you take the next 30 days to just saturate yourself with this scripture, with the promises that God has for you in Psalm 46 and learn it with me and then make a video of yourself and either post it below or send it to us in an email. It will make it sink deep in your heart and it's an eternal glorious promise little package that you get to carry with you from now on. So with no further ado, here's Psalm 46. God is our refuge and strength. He's a very present help in trouble. Therefore, we will not fear, though the earth gives way, though the mountains fall into the heart of the sea, though their waters roar and foam, though the mountains tremble at their swelling. There is a river whose streams make glad the city of God, the holy habitation of the Most High. God is in the midst of her and she will not be moved. He will help her when morning dawns. The nations rage and the kingdoms totter. He utters his voice and the earth melts. The Lord of hosts is our refuge. The God of Jacob is our fortress. Come. Behold the works of the Lord, how He has brought desolations on the earth, how He has made wars cease to the ends of the earth. He breaks the bow and He shatters the spear. He even burns the chariots with fire. Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted among the peoples. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our fortress. <laughs> 